Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to King's Blood. Today, we'll see what's going on. Uh, we do have two new followers. Melina, she's a shapeshifter, apparently a human one, and uh, turns into a giant spider. Spider queen. <sighs> yeah. It's, maybe we can find a spider king at some point? Probably not. Probably not. Most likely dead. Melina transforms into a human-sized spider, granting her a potent venom, adding... Ooh, Ability power damage to her basic attacks. Okay, Melina used to be one of Arthania's brightest scholars. Even as a young woman, she started giving lessons within Moralheim's universities. So, Mushroom Home? Hmm. Then suddenly, from one day to another, she disappeared. Her chambers were opened, and her room looked more like a laboratory than a place where someone would live. Everything was full of little eight-legged specimens. Some of them opened up, some still alive. Her diary was found, and it seemed like she headed towards the southern marshlands for a secret research mission. Unfortunately, the information was vague, and no one really knew where she was heading exactly, and for what reason. Dun, dun, dun. But now we found her. And she can be a friend. Hopefully. Hopefully, a friend. Let's keep her alive a little bit. Get her some more ability power if we can. Yes. And then we'll go for focus region very shortly. Unless... No, I think I'm happy with that. I could try to go to focus region faster. It's probably worth it. Yeah, okay. I have changed my mind yet again. Let's see, do I go for crit chance or attack? Oh, wait, I can... Never mind. I was thinking I'd go here and then there, but this works too. So, there we go. Melina. And here's our new doctor. Curio. Hidden under a dark mask and heavy clothing, the nervous and often anxiously neurotic Curia shields herself from all the invisible evil floating around each and everyone at any given time. People consider her to be crazy, but she strongly believes that sickness is transmitted via the air. She has created countless mixtures and antidotes, but her main goal is to find the fresh root of Ungar, a legendary plant rumored to cure one of the most evil of all illnesses, Demon's Tongue. The constant whispering of demons. An illness which also affects Curia herself. Yeah, that... That tracks. Okay, vaccinate. Curia heals the most wounded ally and renders it invulnerable. That's right. We saw that that seemed like a very good ability. But we want the focus region more than anything so that she can keep throwing that out. Hmm. But I also want her to stay alive to do it. Let's go this way see what we will see so that's two focus regions almost and then we can maybe get to our third four levels versus kind of either way we have to take three reds before we can get to this one but oh well we'll see what we can do Gurk, we got some focus okay ignis we do ability power yeah Okay, and we have seen he can cast that pillar of fire across the map. It doesn't have to be right next to him. I completely misunderstood that when I first read it. Oh, it happens, unfortunately. But we learn. We live. We keep going. Um, crit damage or crit attack speed? Attack speed. Okay, we'll take that. Hmm. Leia. Keep you alive? Get some focus region. We'll go up here, and then back down. We don't really depend on her for damage. Same with Lyrica. We're trying to get to this focus region. Uh, I will go here. That seems the fastest way. Hmm. My Orc Mage. Get some focus region for you. Raz Duval, same deal. We want that focus region. It's just very good for us to get. You, on the other hand, just need more damage. And stuff. I think ability uh, ability power does kind of matter to you. Hmm. I think we go for attack damage though first. Try to get all the reds, then we'll figure out the blues. Play some saxophone maybe in the in the area. We'll see. Okay. Yasmir. Give me that ability power. Lissa. Give me that focus region. Okay. Uh, eventually. We're not there yet. Mm, construction. Finally, can we do the thing? Apparently not. K. 
Okay. What about Trophy Hall? What do you get me? Nothing. Okay, we'll do this for now, and then I probably can click this plus sign in here and get some other things working. Uh, I could try to go for more potions and stuff. Nothing else really matters to me at this point. So I guess the question is, what would be fastest to research? Hmm. This should be completely surrounded by research, so I'd imagine two turns, yeah. Okay, we can brew. Get some good stuff, maybe one or two. Not my favorite. We'll try it again. Okay. Yeah, we're not getting as many healing potions, so you know what? Maybe I need to turn off my minor healing potions so we can get more majors. Same with lures, we probably don't need these anymore. Okay. Yeah. And focus potions, I basically never use, but I should really reconsider that with Roz Duvall and some of our very good things. Hmm. Some of our very good focus abilities. Like, immediate invulnerability might not matter, but it could change the course of fate itself. Like, instant invulnerability at the beginning, but if nobody's hurt, then she's not going to know who to heal or target, so I don't know if that would work well. Hmm. On the other hand, instant spider means just more damage, so... Yeah. Okay. What to do next? Also, I did get... A new setup on my desk for doing stuff. Hmm, we could unlock Gararok. Harry Potter. <laughs> okay, not Harry Potter. Got it, got it. A famous Samson poet once penned the saying, Orcs are orcs. He felt that no matter how much one tries to change them, orcs will always be feral beasts. However, the city of Gararok is where this statement, born from prejudice, loses much of its credibility. Gararok is a city divided between various clans that fight amongst themselves for leadership, solely based on the law of the strongest, with the Wolf Clan as the current holder of that title. That being said, they have proven time and time again that they can cooperate with each other in a civilized manner in times of struggle. Unfortunately, this solidarity ends at the city border. The rest of Aratka, the land of the orcs, is a barbaric cesspool of wickedness and anarchy, save for one or two dim lights within the darkness. The lack of kinship between the clans is a major source of conflict in Aratka, as well as a serious concern for the wolf clan. Hmm. Let's go speak. Let's see, reputation. A uh, heroic item might- oh, 500 arcanium? Okay. I mean, it's worth working towards. Brock the Rock. I feel like we've seen this one before, but, uh... Sure. You are weak to cloud, I believe. Yes, yes. Or storm. Are you storm? No. Okay. Yeah, we can... So this is something I am more recently understanding. We can do that and kind of see who all can get the storm bonus. We can get 20% stun chance, which we don't need. We don't need it. Okay. So, another orc. Do I want a healing orc? We have a healer right here. Uh, now we'll take you, we'll take you. I don't need human assassin, man. Another dwarf would be kind of nice. Hmm. We already have enough elves. I could get another human. Oh, fine. Fine, Garth. You're in. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Curia. What do we want to give you? She is probably going to be our best healer, so honestly. More resistances seems good on our best healer. And health. I bet she does that thing Kakashi does where you never see her underneath the mask even when she's eating. Anyway. So we could try the focus potion immediately. Seems kind of fun. Alternatively. Frost Nova. It's just good. Uh, more Frost Nova, more Lure. You know what? I need to refilter these, don't I? There we go. Give you that. Okay. I think we're pretty happy with that. Hmm. And then a Mystic Helm of Meditation. Focus region plus four per second, magic resistance, ability power. Max. You know what, Curia? 
since you're probably going to be our best supporter, period. We'll do that. Unless we want to put that on, like, Rastaval. Hmm. On Rastaval, this means we destroy everything faster. So, yeah. Yeah. We're going to keep her alive. Hmm. I guess we'll give you the max health. Okay, for now we'll do that. We'll try to give this to Rosdeval. This is for attackers. Speaking of which, we'll do this on you. Attack damage and stun rate. Hmm. We'll give this to you so that we can get more stuns. That's 4% stun rate. We'll try it. Uh, and then, do we want life leech on anybody? I don't think we care that much. Nah. Um, hmm. I'm gonna switch these two. Right? Yeah, that's 5% stun rate now. Okay. We'll try that. And hope it works. Check our next... Reputation. Get some herbs. Hmm. Yeah, back in Ostlingen. Tavern. Alright, more about the soldiers and everybody's having a war. It is said the dwarves of Beradum have gargantuan halls full of gold. If they were not awful at making offspring, they would have the power to rule this land. But forget I said anything about that. They would still have to figure out how to use Grimgard. Maybe they should enslave a king's blood like they do with the halflings. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if that's part of their plan. Didn't King Rufus swear to exterminate everyone next in line? Yeah. Ooh, okay, another gambling chance for 3,000, huh? Oh, the item lottery. A fabulous cape in stock. Oh, so shiny, and even fits the color of your eyes. Yeah. Okay. Probably not worth gambling. Well, no, we can sometimes get some really good items out of it, so... I guess we'll just have to see. Become a Gorian Warrior, Trial 2. So this was really difficult. So I think what we want is try to figure out if Roz Duval can perma stun here. Uh, Pori for damage. Ryo for more damage? Or is this only affecting physical damage with King's Blood? Oh, it's not popping up correctly. Okay. Huh. Well, if it does everybody, that'd be fine. I'll take Yasmir because of her summon golems. Because we've already got front lines otherwise. I might take Marlo. Hmm. Just trying to think if I want to try to get another halfling instead of somebody like Ryo. Like we can. Or maybe I need another fighter. Maybe that's what I need. Who's my halfling here? Pori? Ah, oh, he's damaged, though. Pori is my damage. But if I get rid of you... Could go for another fighter with Glorious. Which gives us our four times bonus. Uh, if I could get a fighter light type... I don't think we have any left. Marlo? We could get Summoner, Light, Human, but not the extra Fighter bonus. Hmm. Uh, I guess we'll try this. Or Pori. No, Pori's just better at dealing damage. Okay. We'll just do this. And see what we will see. You on to Rost. Oh, wherever you are, my good man. Okay. We're going pure focus here. Focus up, Rost we can Frost Nova. I think I would rather Tidal Wave. With Ross Duval. Uh, we could Focus Potion instead, though. You know what? We'll try that. Hmm. Where is that Focus Potion? Do I not have it? I do have it. Focus up. Um... 
Hmm. Give that to Pori. Give this to our tanky people. Oh, Ryo, I think I give you the Frost Nova. You, I think I give the Hand of Resurrection. Maybe. We can't afford to take anything weak here. Could try the five second stun. Let's try the blind. Hmm. Match damage to all enemies on the field. I think we just do this. I think we go for stun, stun, and more stun. It's very fun. But not for them. Okay, we'll try that. Hmm. Take my cake. It increases max HP by 500 and HP region by 10. Wait, is that an item or a consumable? Huh. Well, okay. That sounds pretty good. That's a good deal. Hmm. I think that basically doubles somebody's health. Okay, just double checking. Yeah, so we can get rare items for around 3,000. They're okay. Like, these are pretty good. Quick de deadliness. Hmm. I think I want to save up still for the biggest items as much as I can. So, yeah. 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 Okay. We'll think about it. Okay, you. Mia Goldheart, former captain of Wesley's 3rd Crossbow Regiment. You have gained the respect and trust of Wesley's highest. Well, okay. As a thank you, Lord Ferdinand has ordered me to join you on your adventures and support you in all your future endeavors. Hmm. Be ready to see some action, because I'm ready to fight! Okay. Welcome, Mia. You're an archer. Human with light. Okay. That could have been useful for one of our groups. Oh, well. Uh, we already got that cake. We haven't eaten it yet. Hmm, we've done this stuff. Okay, I think we're happy. Let's see, we've got three more groups we can send out with our full eight. Hmm. I guess we'll check you. Imris the Black. Help! Help! The beast has attacked again! It went into a complete frenzy of destruction! If it attacks again, we'll be doomed! Based on all sightings, Wetsy has discovered the whereabouts of the dragon's lair. I don't think we'll have another chance, but we still need someone to slay the beast. Even the guards of Reverum are reluctant to help us. Will you accept the quest to rid us from this menace? Uh, yes. Yes, I will. Uh, only Ignis cares about destroying dragons, huh? Okay. Fine. No one else cares. Be that way. Uh, Holdor, do I take you? Hmm. I'm definitely taking you and you. We get our halfling synergy that way. And they're kind of tanky. We'll take Marlo for the chance to do more work. I think I do take Glorious still, because he's going to give us that warrior bonus and the human bonus. We need another elf. Elf, elf, elf. Do I take Lyrica? I think I take Lyrica to heal. Your water. Okay, we can get another fire. With Bodo. Or our assassin halfling. Specialist dwarf. We don't have any other specialists, so we'll take Bodo. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. We almost have four elf. Do I want four elf? I don't think I care too much about ability power. Hmm. More stun chance might be nice, though. Who is Earth? Okay, so we could try to take Tara. I think it is Earth instead of Fire. So if I get rid of the Assassin, we could then go for you and get this Fire. More attack speed. Yeah, I think we go for that. Okay. It's kind of weird. 
I don't normally go for those, but that might be what we need here. Hmm. I don't think I want to give anybody the endless cake yet. We must save the slimy yet satisfying cake for later. Hmm. Let me give you this. It's going to be one big enemy, right? So honestly, if we can just keep perma-stunning it, that might be fine. Stone strike. Maybe we just do that. Seems like cheesing it a bit, but... Well, dragons are apparently made of cheese, right? So, should be fine. Should be fine. Hmm. Get more reputation here. Crocolisk. Okay. Rumble in the Jungle Part 1. The jungle on this island would be an endless supply of lumber that could help us expand our sea fleet. If only we can get there safely. But well, we have to pass through the Boa Marshes to get there. It is full of carnivorous and poisonous animals. Especially the crocodiles have become a problem. Do me a favor and get rid of these beasts for us. So we can at least feel a little bit safer. There are three Earth-type crocolisks here. So we want life here if we can. Life. The universe and everything. Okay. We'll take you. You. We get our assassin and life bonus that way. We can take you and you. We get our orc bonus. Can I get one more lifer? I can. And I will. Okay. Then... I think we want to go... Maybe... Mia, Lex, Moros. We'll take uh, we'll take you as a tank, I guess. Hmm. Do I need more damage? I might. Hmm. I think I. Well, we have so many like supporters left. I feel like I should take supporters just so I have some other people that can deal damage in the next party. Yeah. I do want another elf. Hmm. And another dwarf. Okay, specialist won't help here. Oh, you're all specialists. Okay. We do get our dwarf bonus, so you know what? You know what? Sure. We'll do it. Alright. Focus region and magic resistance on somebody new. You can put that on you. Or you. And I'll do that. Marvelous. And then those pantaloons. Hmm. It's a lot of help. Holdor, would that help you? It's probably better than you, just the magic resistance, right? Probably. Okay, and then a bunch of attack damage. Hmm. But not enough attack damage. Okay. Yeah, no, I think we're good. Okay, we just need items. Items, items, items. So crocolisks are probably A-OK -okay with all this stuff. Hmm. A Holdor, what do I give you? I guess I'll give you the Nova. All right. So there's that, and we can send one more group... What do we want here? Hide and squeak? Hmm. Do I need reputation here? I kinda do. Okay. So hopefully it's an easier quest, since we don't have too many attackers left. We have a lot of supporters. Okay. But well, we got our four halfling bonus. Alright, alright, we'll take it, we'll take it. Hmm. You can Better go here. Stuff we got in the army. Okay, we can give you magic resistance. And health, maybe. Hmm, crit rate? Attack speed would be nice because of the ability power bonus damage. Hmm. I don't know if I have anything left like that. We can give you focus region. Sure. 
Uh, and then we just give more minor things. More minor things. Okay. Away we will go. And that should be everyone. Find the right moment to strike. Uh, and then, yeah, I wonder if we have to attack the little... Hmm, where'd they go? The uh, armies of River Rum somehow. It's like, they're over here. Oh, I haven't unlocked Olo shit. Okay. Well, apparently I have more skill points. Who leveled? Oh, right, right, right. You. Mia has been captain of Wesla's 3rd Crossbow Regiment. Despite her fragile stature, her temperament and skills on the battlefield earned her the respect in front of many, mostly male soldiers. While her temper occasionally leads to wild screaming, she always remains her calm in difficult combat situations. Being loyal to the Wesla forces, she hates Riverum with a passion, and waits for the day the tides are turned and Goldstead will finally be the capital of the kingdom. Interesting. Uh, Mia empowers one of her bolts, dealing a bunch of damage, and stunning! Okay, and it's the furthest target available, which is good against magicians and the like. Okay. So let's get this stuff working. Hmm, do I want HP region? Probably not. I don't care that much for it. Hmm. But it does lead me to more ability power. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that. Oh, alright then. Hmm. Okay. Motivated to go for criminals and things, and... Alright. We'll try this. We'll try this. Here we go. Battleground. Jumping rat. Jumping rat, indeed. I think that might be the only jumping rat, though. Yeah. Okay. Hmm... Okay, we don't exactly have the best stuff going here. You don't really deal damage, but yeah. Millie, put you here or here. We'll put you there. Do that. Okay. Let's try to focus one side at a time. They can't leap into our line this way very well. So you're going to try to leap over here. We'll see how that goes. Yeah. This should be kind of fun. Okay, well, she transforms. She does heal like the other shapeshifters. Okay. Important. Our barricade did some work here. Good work, barricade. Good work. Okay. Then we have a happy dwarf. So, all's well that ends well. Attack damage and focus regen. Attack damage, attack speed, and stun rate. Max health and initial shield. I think we take the heavy spear of quickness. Okay, especially since we have some more attackers that don't have too much good stuff yet. Moach is here. You're gonna jump. You're gonna jump. Put you guys over there. Zorvash. Put you there. I'll try this. Hmm. Let's try to have most of these guys focus on this left side. We'll see how it goes. Also gonna slow down combat a little bit. Guys, he is gonna die on me. Good do the cross motion. Keep Moach alive. Mostly kept him alive. Oh my goodness, he's still alive. Okay. Well, we'll take it. I did lose one person. But that's okay. They're not dead. Okay, Mindful Amulet of Sturdiness or Book of Arcane Protection. These are higher rarities, so we get more Arcanium out of them. Max Health and Focus Region 4. Okay, well, that's that's pretty good. Do, 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 do. Glorious and the Dirty Pack. Wouldn't that be a great title for your collection, Ignaz? Oh. 
Ignace wants none of this. Okay, you go here. You stay back, guys. And Marl can come from the end. You stay over here. Okay, I'm thinking spreading out will be good against a dragon. We uh, we will see. Emerus the Black. A black dragon in all its glory. This majestic beast must be one of the biggest threats which you might encounter in all of Arthania. His dragon breath strikes in a straight line and hits all adjacent enemies, dealing four times ability power magical damage, 7,000 health. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna play this one with a lot of stuns. It said dodge, but he's still stunned. We stun again. Stun again. Did he just? Huh. Yeah, I don't think it works. Huh. Okay, that's not who I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see Emrys. Yeah, we've done well. Oh, seventeen thousand now. Why does it look like he's? Yeah. We haven't done much damage. Wow, we stunned him for probably 25 seconds and it still wasn't nearly enough. So I think we do need like the full warrior bonus for the magic resistance and ability power and, uh, and armor and stuff. Huh. I think Emrys wins. Damage dealt. Tara did great. Ignis did not. Hmm. Yeah, we couldn't get enough summons out. Basically, melee attackers we don't want too many of, though. Because then that, that fire breath seems to take them out immediately. Hmm. So I think we want, like, Yasmir to instantly summon a golem. And then keep summoning golems quickly. That seems like the best idea. Maybe Noki as well. But summons, and then, like, a bunch of archers or something. Really high stun chance, maybe, with Earth. Okay. Retry later. We will see. We'll see. But Emrys is uh, living up to that black dragon power fantasy. Okay. But yeah. I think we might not have dealt nearly enough damage, so... Hmm, I might need to decrease the difficulty as well. Yeah, you guys are gonna jump. Like all y'all. Hmm. Rost of Bone. Okay. Hmm. Okay. You guys should jump to the back here. Hmm. I think I just need to spread out a bit more. And then our guys in the middle can go attack whoever. Thorbin will probably be dealing the most damage. So I think we actually kind of want people nearer to Thorbin. Okay, we'll, we'll try this. That. Do that. Okay. I could focus potion Razdevol. I guess we will. These tigers are pushovers, but we did a lot better against them than the dragon. Which, you know, fair, I suppose. Okay, ooh, mighty staff of shielding. Hmm. I'd rather have mighty staff of focus region, but oh. Deadly Ring of Arcane Protection. Traveler's Pants of Sturdiness. Hmm. This is probably the best one. Okay. Hmm. A giant is nothing in the face of a true warrior. Rawr. Okay, then. Let's see. Do you do... You get armor when reaching full focus. Hmm. Stone giants usually ignore humanoid beings as they do not regard them as a threat. Though when being attacked, they can harden their skin. Which is pretty interesting. Let's see, let's spread out a bit. 
Maybe that will be better for us, maybe not. We can hope. We'll do this. Why did you? Hmm. Target advisor. We'll do that. Huh. Are you? Okay, no, you survived. Well, all right then. We'll take it. Damage dealt. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Magnus, Jorla, Shoga, Garth. Didn't last long enough for Garth to amp up the damage. Uh, if he kept getting the stuns, though, that's more than more than good. Healing. Kept him alive. So yeah, we kept him alive by, I guess, turning him invulnerable a couple times. Okay, we could do plate mail of shielding. Nimble ring of shielding. Probably gonna go for that. Hmm. Yeah, nimble ring of shielding. Okay. So it is decided. War is coming. Hmm. It is, but we are prepared. I know. Still, I am worried. What if anything goes wrong? It won't. There's no one who can outbid us. Hmm. Not even the dwarves. The Gorian Riders are on our side, but we have to be quiet about it. No one needs to know. Rivrum will be shocked when they stand in front of our doors. Then the trap will snap. Our spy network did a great job. Let's hope for the best. Hmm. We'll see how that goes next time, dear viewer. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying King's Blood, and have a great day.